them. Them? them? Oh, you didn't know? Dawn took Omni out for the reward challenge. Well, bye. Do you hear something? No, nothing. It sounds like Morse code. No, no, no. SOS. SOS. <laughs> what happened? Provided this to you will be severely punished. Inka! Don! I thought you brought Omnia for the reward challenge. No way! They set everything up! No, please do not disturb our guests. But she has something very important to tell her father. Little tramp. Inka, wait in here. Inka. What are you doing? I don't want you to marry Kimmy. You thought I was going to propose to Kimmy? Well, she was trying on mom's ring. She's my PA. I asked her to get a ring for you. I knew that you could wear mom's ring and I needed her to get one in that size. Rubbish. It's true. No. I meant rubbish, there's so much rubbish. How are we going to find a ring like this? She came to pass me the ring today. She's not going to work tomorrow. And I needed the ring so that I could give it to you after uh, I pick you up from camp. Baloney! It's true. No, no, I meant someone drew a perfectly good piece of baloney away. I knew the time would come sooner or later. I met your mama, she was your age. I gave her a ring then, because I knew she was the one. I realized that after all this time, I've been using you to keep mom alive for me. But it's time for you to live your own life. That stinks! Inka! No, no, I mean, the fish stinks. So I came to the plaza. You're going to be away. And I didn't want to be alone on June 13th. At least here somehow, still feels like your mom is with me. What you did, Dad, was really sweet. I'm sorry I thought those things about you and Kimmy. Inga, seriously, please believe me when I tell you that there'll be no one to replace your mom. No one. I thought that what you said was all a lie. Why would I lie about the love of my life? Yeah. I thought you wouldn't tell me the reason why. Couldn't you have 
I said a thing or two, what you were up to. What you were up to Thought you were full of lies Hope we can find my surprise Someday will I remember What you wanted to give Kemper Dawn, you're late. You were supposed to report at 1600 hours. Sorry, sorry, I, I couldn't get a bus in it. Excuses are not tolerated. By the way, where's Kemper Inka? Uh, she, she, uh, she told us she's got something on. It's important, she'll be back. I don't care what important things she has on. This is Kem, and by Kem rules, she has to be back by curfew. I said she will be back. Are you threatening me, Kemper Chris? My friend has something to settle. She will be back. Kemper Chris, do not speak to me in that tone. Do you know who I am? Do you know who we are? We? Are you some split personality or what? One moment you're mean, and then the next moment you're girly, and... Call me girly one more time, and the only thing that's gonna split are your lips. <laughs> I found him like this. It's it, boo. It's it, boo. Whoa. Winston. 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 Tell me what happened. It's it, boo. It's it, boo. There can be no scientific rational explanation for what I saw. I'm going home now. Winston, don't be silly. No, I'm going home. I miss my encyclopedia. I miss my calculator. I miss my mom. I miss my dad. I did it. Winston kept saying that he didn't believe in ghosts. So I wanted to play a little trick on him. I guess it went a bit too far. But, but he does look so cute when he's scared. Sorry. He loves me. 
He loves me not. He loves me. He loves me not. Oh. I need to tell him. Hi, Commander Dan. Hey, Commander Dan. Oh. Hey, Commander Dan. Yo, yo, Commander Dan. Good morning, Commander Dan. Yeah, that's right. Good morning, Commander Dan. I was just wondering, you know.